As a Yugi Boomer, I have only just discovered how incredible Pendulum cards are, how much I love them, and how they will destroy everything. Pin best deck, trip gaming, always right. So today, we're going to be channeling our inner Yu Yu Sakaki, and let's dive right in. Hello? This is Yu Gi Oh! Call. Can you please come play? Oh, yeah! Yo, what's going on, everyone? American Bacon here, and we are in the Limit One Festival like everyone else in the world. Uh, it's fucking fun, man. I uh, I tried a couple of different things. I ended up uh, using using my odd eye strategy in the limit one because there's so many things I like to do with like the odd eyes and uh, I mean typically I normally use just odd eyes and uh, like magicians, but I put some other stuff in here. You just can't fit it all into one deck, but now you can. But this also means sometimes you get brick hands, sometimes you get good hands, and we just have to kind of see how it's going. Um, should we stop it? Yeah, let's, I don't know what they're playing, so fucking let's be safe. Let's stop it. Incredible that I actually got my Ash Blossom. I keep getting fucking Ash Blossom in this, and I'm like, how? There's only one. But look, I got it too, so I can't complain that much. Okay. Yeah, currently, nothing too fantastic. Hopefully, we can draw a Pendulum card here, so just <sighs> draw. Oh, that's just as good. Now, the issue is they're going to have... Uh, they're either way it'll be okay but they're gonna have a fucking uh ash blossom now watch okay all right we're about to skip a b all right all right so uh let's grab arc pendulum this will be perfect so it'll just straight up be perfect p scale oh i like to do it the other way but i mean this will work too um for you, for you out there who are like, oh, pendulums are so stupid. Dude, pendulums are the fucking best. All right? Triff Gaming is completely right. He's a little crazy. But pendulums are the fucking best. I love pendulums. They're so good. They're so versatile. Especially odd eyes. There's so many things I can do. Even when I can't beat someone, I can still beat them. Like, there's so many ways I can I can just keep pulling odd eyes onto the, onto the field. And as I'm playing, I'm always finding new strategies and stuff. Uh, there's no need to activate that right now because we're not pendulum summoning yet. So we will keep it in hand. Um, actually, ooh, actually, yes, activate it. We can get this guy out. I never get this guy out. Ooh. I only run this guy in this deck. I don't run him in my main deck. I just thought, oh, he'd be good tech in this deck. I had to pay attention because normally, like I said, it's the other way. So normally uh, the low is on that side. So I had to really... Focus there so I didn't make his fucking thing seven and piss myself off. Okay, now we got this. Um, this card declares an attack. You can make this card gain a thousand attack for each monster on the field. This card attack is higher than its original attack, even except other monsters you control, except other monsters you control. What? Whose attack supposed to be higher? Okay. Um, this card is struck by battle or card effect while it card attack is higher than its original attack. It is. Target one monster in your grip, right? Special summon it. Um, Ash Blossom. Ash Blossom gonna come play. Let's see. It's gonna be a fucking uh, man eater bug. Yeah, it just said I can't do it, but yeah. Why not? Oh, it's Sangan. Motherfucker's playing Exodia. God damn. What am I gonna do? Um, I built. Uh, so every time I get 4,000 gems, I build a new deck. Uh, tip, I mean, typically. Not always, but when I'm wanting to, to do a deck, I, I get 4,000 gems together, I open up some secret packs, and I build a deck, right? And those last one, I was like, I want to build insects. I was like, insectors would be cool, because like I know in the TCG, they have a lot of support. And I was like, oh, that'd be cool. So I uh, so I, I did it. I, I got the, basically, there's just like an insect pack, thankfully. It kind of includes all the best insects. Um, grab uh, Mirror Shield. This card's awesome. Yes. This is why it's important to have him out, because now I get a special summon an odd eyes. We're gonna pick Wizard Dragon. And if you destroy Wizard Dragon, he can special summon another odd eyes, and then Art Pendulum can special summon another odd eyes. And uh the way I like to do it, because uh Wizard Dragon's effect isn't once per turn. So you use his effect to summon a new odd eyes, and then you use Ark's effect to summon him back. If he gets destroyed, he gets to summon another odd eyes back. So you get three odd eyes in one turn essentially. What is go what are you doing? What is going on? 
You control another monster, so you can tribute this card special summon two time thieves? Oh no! Oh no! But yeah, in Insector's kind of ass without the, the new support cards. So I pivoted on that. Uh, we're working about with Battle Wasps and like um, a Big Ballpark and like with some normal monsters in there and shit like that. And uh, I actually found a really good way to get a, to get a level, level 10 out super easily. Uh, there's a level two tuner battle wasp and then you can bring this level one monster that you can just special summon if you have an insect on the field and then you use the uh the uh i can't remember what it's called it's like an ant army card you you tribute one card and then one insect monster and you get two level four tokens and you can use those along with the tutor to get a level 10 out uh which is super cool and like super unique i had never even thought about doing that <gasps> oh no I'm gonna, am I gonna get fucked here? This is gonna, they're gonna go deep. Are they gonna OTK my ass or something? I don't have any negation on the field. Ah, oh, I should've, why did I put Super Poly down? I could literally do it right now. Oh, what a misplay, what a misplay. So when they beat me here, it's all my fault. I could've waited till they were done and then just done something. Oh yeah. <laughs> You are the weakest link. Goodbye. Let me, I think I'm, uh, uh. Damn boy, look at that. Yep, I should have put, that was on me. Super Polly would have saved my ass. So much right there. Okay, on to the next one. We'll do one or two more. Those rabbits still give me, those rabbits give me PTSD at this point from all those fucking bots where it was like, okay, well, I'll just play my turn and then walk away for eight minutes. Watch anime, get another hobby while in the middle of it. What do we get? That's not a bad hand. Not a great hand though, to be honest. No hand traps. We'll see what they do. Is that, is that all you're doing, dog? Ooh, Elvich? Elvich, question mark? Maybe. Okay, sure. Maybe, maybe not. Ooh, maybe Elvich. <laughs> Just get Harvey Feather to the Just to fuck with him, man. Just to fuck with him. Let's do it. Hey, we can uh, probably get something out. Let's activate this to hopefully bait anything out. Nope. Okay, work, buddy, work. No Ash Blossom, no Ash Blossom, no Ash Blossom. No Ash Blossom! Okay, um, our bad boy here. Now one to, one to eight, get a seven out. Get the old wizard dragon looking cool. Well, the fucker, look, he's got those Doctor Strange powers. He's got his shields. He'll go, bah, duh, get you. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. But anyway, let's get him out on the field. Uh, no, don't want to change that currently. Too bad he's not a pendulum monster. We would get a counter. After three counters of this card, you get to uh, uh, do a... Uh, second summon base a second pendulum summon in a turn basically for each counter all your pendulum monsters get boosted by 300 attack so it's it's not a lot but i've definitely had games where like it definitely mattered you can activate your traps i'd imagine you wouldn't just put two face down cards and then just like let it go through Ooh, look at you <laughs> i would say i'm just gonna say pick someone else just to just because it'd be funny. It's not a hard choice, man. There's one card attacking you. The other cards I can just put right back on the field immediately. Okay, let's cook this. And put this. Okay. End it. Can't do another pendulum summon. So we'll just have to hope that this defends us for the turn. They seem like they might be playing like maybe a stall deck or some annoying kind of deck. Oh. Just leave it like that. I will destroy both those bitches right now. Oh, uh, yeah. They're playing some sort of stall deck. Is that fucking Torrential? No, no, no. It's Chris Dabdor. Okay. I thought it was like, that fucking Torrential? Yeah, what does this do? Uh... Control no monsters, of course, of course. You take no battle damage, of course. The end of battle phase of this card, battle shuffle all cards from your opponent's graveyard into their deck. 
Okay, so it's going to do a thousand damage to me. Definitely not upset about this. That would be pointless. So I'm not going to waste it. Oh my god, that sucks. Two good cards. Wouldn't want to draw either of those. What if I draw one right now? What if though? What if? Huh! Oh, flame. Not bad. We can... We can do something. I don't want to do what I'm thinking about doing though. None of you have negates on you necessarily, but we will put you out here so we'll be able to get it a going. Ooh. Oh yeah, baby. There, boom. We got a counter. Let's go. What do you have? You have no effects. Like, what can you do, dog? Okay, so we're probably going to go into absolute here. As absolute as a direct path into Vortex. And we want Vortex for sure. Vortex is like the best card. <laughs> Which I was thinking about getting Vortex. Um, are you going to destroy my card? This turn control takes damage equal to. Oh, okay. Well, I was just going to get my wizard back, but it'll be okay. I got to get rid of him first, though. It'll be all right. Yep, go back to the hand. These, I've faced a couple of these decks. None of them have beat me yet because they're just not. Oh, God, fuck you. God damn it. Okay. That's fine. I can get, I can get, I can make stuff happen, so don't worry about it. Like, we got Vortex fodder at this point. And this card will destroy itself for Vortex. We can get another Odd Eyes on the field. We got a Counter Gate just in case anything crazy goes down. What can you do? What what hand trap do you have, homie? We're just gonna negate this motherfucker. Yep. Get rid of him because that's who I want. Boom. Now we got two special summons sitting here, just chilling. No current pendulums, but that's okay. We're doing it. We're doing the thing. We're still... I think we're going to win. Like... What's up, baby? What's up? What I say? Yeah, I mean... I mean, the stall decks, as we all know, they're all real fucking annoying. I get the, I get the gimmick. Fun. Haha. -ha. Not really. With my regular auto, that almost have dark. I'll have to... Stop it! Stop being so dark! Might have to fix that in post. Anyway... Uh, with my regular auto deck, I usually still beat them. I have so many ways to uh, negate attacks and to, uh, like, with odd eyes effects and return cards to hand and be able to do damage to them. Or I have cards that can negate their effects and then you can just fucking smack a card with zero attack and defense and send it to the graveyard for good. So, okay, what'd we get? Nothing too bad, nothing too great. Um, actually, let's summon him first. Let's bait. If they have an ash, we can ash with that. Okay, no Ash. We know that for sure. Uh, we all, we will, we will put this boy in the graveyard. Okay. Spiral Flame. Okay, phone. You like that. And it's only monsters. We will have to use... You're an Earth type, and you're an Earth type, so... Uh... One dark monster. Yep. One light monster. Yep. Okay. We're just going to grab old Ark here. I'm going to keep Ark in my hand for now. But we will set these two. And I wish I had just a regular level one link there. That'd been fantastic. But I don't. Just a 
get something maybe better with some effects or something on the field. That can do me good. Former Pal Second Donkey is really good in this deck because either you have your scale set up, right? Oh shit, I just noticed that there's like scales in this, which I hadn't seen before. That's sick. Um, so either you have your scale set up, then you get to put a perform Performer Pal in your hand. And that's awesome. Um, yeah, get that shit out of my house. <laughs> I am not even playing. I will waste it. Just to destroy your fucking... Just destroy your Desperia. Despia or whatever. Get that shit out of my fucking house, dude. Um, yeah, either you have the Pendulum Scale set up, or you... And if you do, you get to add a performer pal to your hand, right? And if you don't, then you get to send one to the graveyard so you can mill a card basically either way. And honestly, it's, it's worth doing either way. Like, uh, I summoned him for the first time ever in that, that first duel I did in this video. And that was great. That was the only time I've ever summoned him. So usually I use him as fodder like this. Ooh, what are we doing? What are we doing? Or oh, Flufflin? What kind of deck you could run into split? What? I had no idea this is what we were doing. Okay. I'm cool with this. Goodbye. Ah! I think the Mimic has an effect in the graveyard, though. Add one Frightful card from your deck to your hand. Yeah. Won't help you this turn, motherfucker. Oh, if we can get another Pendulum card, we can get him on the field. That's another destruction. That'd be great. That would just be fantastic. Come today, to fucking to 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 today, Junior. What's that card do? Add one Edge and Monster, one Polymerization from your deck to your hand. Okay. Yeah, see, that's, that's a pretty mean board. Because we got a bad hand, so that's a pretty mean board, honestly. That one's so kind of creepy and cute at the same time. It looks like its tail looks like the back end, like the hilt of a sword, right? That one's just fucked up, man. That guy needs to go to the doctor. He's having a hard time in life. Okay. Something good. Something perfect. Something just the best thing ever. Advanced Dragon. Advanced Dragon, you are not the best thing ever. Um, uh, but we can actually make this work. Check it. As long as he doesn't destroy this immediately, we can get Advanced Dragon out there with Arc Pendulum. Okay. That's no destruction. Okay. No. Actually, just gonna waste. Yes. You can destroy one monster your opponent controls if you do inflict damage to your opponent. Uh, yes. This one. Now he's going to have to... Now he'll waste that negate. Yep. And I can special summon him back, right? Yes. Now, I don't normally play it like this because I don't have hands like this very often. So, you can only activate one of those a turn. So you get destroyed. Yep. Pull my boy back. What's your effect? Yep. Never. We're just going to destroy you. We're not going to let you destroy us. Peace. Ha! Bas basically brick hand and still pulled it off. Still cleared the board. Have a fucking... They're going to harpy feather dress me. But I have a card on the field that'll... Especially someone another odd eyes of mine gets destroyed for protection. So... We're chilling, dude. We're really, we're really just chilling right now. Like, this is probably gonna go in our favor. I say that, and now they're gonna like, they're gonna, they're gonna play the best card in the world somehow. They're gonna, wait, they're gonna put this card down. What's gonna do is it's gonna destroy every card in my field, and then special summon every card in their graveyard back in attack position with triple attack. That's, that's how it's gonna go. Oh wait, don't wait. Do we steal one? Do we do it? Yo, let's do it. 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 Which one? We'll take the. We'll take Saber Tooth. Wait, 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 what's Sabretooth's effect? Because the other one's so good. What's Sabretooth's effect? Ah, shit. What is it? 
I mean, it basically has no effect, but I like the way it looks. So, <laughs> and we're stealing it anyway. We don't need the effects. We're probably gonna be, we're probably gonna leave as soon as I do this. Woo! Give me that. Battle. You're like, shit, my monster. Destroy it. Do it. Oh, this turns us to face down. No. Okay, so they kind of cleared both of our, our fields like that. That's interesting. Was not expecting that. Should have just saved the monster reborn, honestly. Shouldn't have stunted on him like that. It was a bad idea. Now we're about to get stunted on. Watch. I was feeling myself too much. Ugh. Not gonna go too well for us, I feel. If we had just sat still, we could have brought him back and then, you know, been chilling. A free a free negate or free destroyer on the field. Would have been great. These cards annoy me so much. Cause they it's cause they do too good of a job. They recycle too well. And it just pisses me off to no end. Most of the time. Oh! Great, yeah. <laughs> really, really regretting using that monster board. Oof. Probably GG's. Hard the cards. I don't even know what I can get that would help, but hard the cards. Save me. Ah. Okay. GG's. Check out that monster born in my hand. But that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you did, make sure you like, subscribe, all the good stuff. And I'll catch you on the next one.